everybody welcome back my name is michael riley host of the uninformed states of america podcast which you can go to the usapodcast.com and subscribe to which will be a treat for yourself but uh yeah i am here representing the grassroots democrats hq in los angeles uh which is pretty interesting because uh you lisa <laughs> are not even in Los Angeles, which I think is really, 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 really awesome uh, because it shows how there's a connectivity here. So because ever since the COVID-19 thing kind of happened, um, <clears throat> as a lot of people know, our physical headquarters at the Grassroots Demo Democrats HQ hasn't been open. So we've been having to uh, reach out to people in a virtual sense uh, to keep the blue wave going, which is something that you've been doing. So that's pretty cool. So Lisa, you're out in Georgia, right? Yeah, I'm in Georgia. Yeah, like uh, so. Being out in Georgia, how important was it to connect with another uh, crew all the way on the other side of the country to uh, campaign for <clears throat> your campaign for Mark Kelly? That, that's right, right? Yeah. So how important was it to connect with the crew way on the other side of the country to campaign for a candidate in a whole nother state? It was really crucial. It was really important as I kind of, if it wasn't for at least the internet, there would be no way that I'd be able to connect in the first place or have any kind of um, information as to what is going on in Los Angeles as well as Arizona in the first place. So I think um, the internet was very helpful to that. Man, um, technology. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. That's really cool. So how'd you even get hooked up with the Grassroots Dem HQ? So um, I am a part of this organization called the High School Democrats of America. I founded my own club at my school. What? And, yeah, and I'm the wow. president. Hey, and, that's cool. Yeah. I got a little excited about that. I think that's I think that's dope. Anyway, continue. My fault. Thank you. So um, through High School Democrats of America, they host a like Friday Zoom meeting where they phone bank for Mark Kelly and a few other politicians hoping to run for office. And I decided to attend one of these and I got really close with um, the head of these meetings, which is Miss Tamara. And we, and she asked me if I wanted to be a fellow with her. And that's how I got introduced to all of this in the first place. And that's how I was able to connect with the fellowship and grassroots demos. Man, that is an inspiring story. Uh, hopefully you can spread that to some of your high school friends there and get them more involved. That is so cool. So tell us about this race with Mark Kelly. How, is, how, how crucial is it for Mark Kelly to, uh, to, to, to beat out Ms. Martha there? It is really important. Um, so the way that um, our director has been telling, uh, telling us about it, it is really important that they win. Because not only does, if, not only if Mark wins, but if Carl Tepernani wins and Joe Biden wins, then that's, that's able to flip Arizona. Because right now Arizona is at a really crucial point where Mark Kelly is. Um, it's not necessarily blue and we're trying to make sure that it is we would really like to see the blue wave take over arizona and to see them some places in arizona um, depending on their um their the people within their seats such as his um his incumbent um we really need to change those seats as they are red yeah absolutely well, you are doing the Lord's work there, Lisa. Thank you so much. Yeah, <laughs> Thank man. You. Yeah. Always remember out there, if you want to be just like Lisa and sign up to volunteer, to phone bank, to uh, text phone bank, or you, I think it's like text bank, I think is what they call it. You can write postcards. You can head over to grassrootsdems.org, grassrootsdems.org, and sign up. Thank you so much, Lisa. Of course. Thank you so much for giving me your time.